Hey guys, so if you haven't heard yet, Grip was just named the number one app for ag in 2024 by both CropLife and Growing Produce, and I'm going to show you why. To the, my sides, I have equipment at my local rental center. I have Grip installed on them. I'm going to show you how it works. I'm simply going to open by starting my uh, system camera. I'm going to come up to the Grip tag. I'm going to grab that QR code. It's going to open up a equipment profile for that piece of equipment. So in this case, we have our Yanmar loader. Uh, and I'm going to update the hours because this just came back in. And uh, if we added 10 more hours, I can either just key that in or I can use the plus and minus buttons to adjust that uh, and put that update in. And we're good to go. Now we see here on the piece of equipment that there's a check oil daily sticker. A lot of times there's uh, hydraulic considerations, cleaning considerations, fuel considerations. And we can also use the, compute, the daily check in grip to capture that all together. Now on my right side, I have another piece of equipment. This is going to be our Beretto stump grinder. Uh, and I'll show you how it works a little differently here. Again, opening my system camera, grabbing that grip tag, QR. I'm gonna open that equipment profile. And in this case, it's not necessarily I need to record hours or anything, but I do need to create a report because I was just told that the hydraulics were leaking. So I'm gonna quickly add a picture for what's going on here. Uh, it was actually, up by the cylinders. Okay, so I grabbed a picture of that, submit that through. There was reported that there's a minor leak by the cylinder head. And I'll title that leak. And I can submit that report. Now I'll often get asked just how easy or difficult is it to start using grip on your equipment? And uh, we're going to show you how it just takes 30 to 60 seconds to set a piece of equipment up using grip. I have a grip tag. I have a piece of equipment that is not yet tagged. So I'm simply going to come over here. I'm going to open my grip app. <clears throat> I'm going to scan this tag to start. And it will immediately prompt me to say, what do you want to set this up as? So I'll go ahead and first take a picture of the asset. There we go. Looking good. Okay, I'm going to call this my Yanmar Mini X. Okay, and I'll add that. So now that's in my asset list, just like all the other pieces of equipment earlier today. Now I can immediately start reporting on this piece of equipment. In this case, uh, treads are a little dirty. So we're going to say uh, needs a power washing. and I will add a picture of the treads. Okay. Not the dirtiest, but we like to keep clean equipment here. So that picture is now added. It'll upload. I don't need to necessarily put a title. All I have to do is just submit that report in and that'll be added to my list. And like before, I can go back. I can see all the pieces of uh, equipment that I have and the details around them. I can easily filter out if I'm a farm manager some of the main issues and I can see there's a leak I reported earlier, uh, a couple other things I need to take care of and then when this is done I can quickly mark that as done. It'll record who I am, when that happened and remove that from my list. So that's grip and now with that new tag I onboarded I'll simply put it in a place that's easily accessible for any operator to come in and like before we can start tracking daily activities, quick checks, oil levels, 